which of the following curves uh, represent the graph of a function of x. So uh, we're going to apply the vertical line test here. And the vertical line test, um, we just need to look at different vertical lines. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and move this vertical line around and see, does it cross the graph um, more than once? So for this first one, I, I move through and you can see that um, we'll actually use here this, this point on the top, okay? Uh, that point, as I move, only ever crosses the graph once, okay? It doesn't, uh, doesn't ever graph, cross the graph more than once. That means it passes the vertical line test and therefore uh, it does represent a function of x. This is a function of x. Okay, the next one is, uh, is kind of fun uh, to think about because as I move this, of course, it only touches the graph in this one spot right here. Okay, and at this x value, you can see, well, and how many spots does it intersect the curve? Well, it intersects right here and right here and right here and all the way down every single spot. That's an infinite number of places. Well, that means that this is not a function of x because it does not pass the vertical line test. Not a function of x. Okay, and finally, the third one here, uh, as we move this through, follow that top point on this line, okay, as we move through, we're crossing just once, and once I hit right here, okay, you'll notice there's a hole in that, in the upper spot. The point is actually down here, and so even here, it's not crossing the graph more than once. And then as I move through, I, uh, we're just crossing there at that one spot, and then again, we've got another one of those jumps. But this jump's a little bit different. And how is it different? Well, I've got this filled in point right here and this filled in point right here, which means when my vertical line is right there, it does cross the graph twice. And if it crosses more than once, then we know that the curve does not represent a function of x. So this is not a function of x.